Hey, what's up, everybody? Um, so we were talking about some of the G major scale and, and how it's starting to tie into some of the other stuff and some of the, the scale stuff and how scales are boring, but you can make them unboring. And you make them unboring with noodling, but there's also patterns in the scale. So what I mean by that is like I might play a six. So in the G major, which I just showed you, and we're gonna use the two positions I just showed you. If I count out six from the major, one, two, three, four, five, six, and I play the root and then the six, then I go to the next note A and play six, up, it's a cool sounding thing. So I might go, whatever, but I, I'll use it to jump around. There were six in there. George Lynch just does them like, he does them like that. It's a really cool thing, but I'm going to show you a lick. So using this, that blues note off of the, the A, if you look at the G major scale down here, so I'm gonna play off of the high E, the, the uh, third fret with my first, and I'm gonna go two, two and three are my fingers, one, two, and three. And I'm gonna just go uh, third fret, fourth fret with my second finger on the B, and then third fret with my third finger, my ring finger. And then I do that uh, same pattern starting on the B string. So I might slide into the lick. And then the other part of that is I'll stay in this position. And then I'm going to go open G. And then I play four and five with two and my my second and third ring and then back to the high E on the third so I use that all over the net so it's a combination of two licks and this is how I'm going to show you right now how you make licks in the scales not boring so I might take a lick like this or this and I add another lick to it where I might be up here on the high E and I play 12 on the B and I hammer to the 13th and then on 12, 13, 14 on the G So I'm combining these licks with some of the scales. So, um, and all all the notes are in the scale. I'm just creating licks in the scale. And, and you, that lick you can do down here too. Now there, I just went. The, the fourth fret to the, to the fifth fret. So, like that. I just did something cool and I don't even know what I did and I had to go back and kind of relearn it. That's the cool stuff about guitar. You know, and this is the kind of stuff that, like I said, a lot of these guys aren't going to teach you. And it's the combination of putting... Com it's like a boxer. you you got to learn different punches, hooks, straight shots and then you put these combinations together and you see what works the best for you some people aren't good at picking some people are better at picking that's kind of one of the things that you got to figure out and that that's just personal preference on your own so here's the other thing i'm going to show you and i'll do it scalar um and i'll try to play up here watch <laughs> Watch my hand, and that's awkward to do it like that. It looks like a sweeping motion, like I was saying, it shakes. 
it's it's like a weird thing that I picked up a long time ago, like shaking and rotating my thumb. And that's what I get asked about the most because people are like, I can't tell if you're picking, but you look like you're sweeping. So it's one of those things. It's just a, a weird thing that I do. That's another technique you can work on. It's just something you got to kind of figure out. There's no explanation for it. So this is another short video. So now you got some of the uh, arpeggios with the other thing. And there's a couple more licks in there for you. So now you can start tying some of the stuff together. All right. Um, please, please, please like and subscribe to the channel. The subscription is the biggest thing. Um, because, you know, people are going to see it and like it anyway. May dislike it. but um, And we'll get into the super shreddy stuff. Stuff that people aren't doing. You know, I see a lot of the shred stuff. And uh, we'll get into that. All right. Because I do some stuff that... Uh, you, you've never seen, not even on YouTube around the world. All right, so peace out.